Ag Week TV, presented by Kaler Farms. The ag equipment market has struggled along with the farm economy, but a Devil's Lake ag equipment manufacturer has gotten a boost from foreign markets. Summers Manufacturing was started in the 60s by Harley Summers, building the Herman Harrow. As Mikkel Pates found, it's grown through the years. Well, the North American market is uh, a little bit down, but the international market is perking along, and that's helping some of the folks in the farm equipment business up in Devil's Lake, North Dakota. It's uh, having an upward tick, so it helps, helps us when domestic is, is slower. Summers Manufacturing makes 14 product lines, including tillage and sprayers, land rollers, and rock pickers. But the drop in commodity prices starting in 2013 had a major impact on their business. That was probably the biggest effect, along with um, we've seen some of the, the European manufacturers come over here too and try to get a foothold for some of their tillage products. Realizing that we had built up this company in so many ways, and all of a sudden, um, it got very quiet as far as, you know, the sales, um, which led to very hard decisions. Um, the decisions to, you know, lay people off, lay them off, bring them back, you know, cut hours, things like that. Those were hard, and it was hard on the people. Summer's president, Deborah Anderson, is Harley's daughter. She says business will probably never return to its pre-recession levels, but an increase in international business has picked up some of the slack. When this um, economy, you know, has been a little depressed, the export or international has really been a, a blessing to us. Summer's biggest international customers are Russia, Ukraine, and Kazakhstan. Vice President of Sales Brian Percune says it's a natural fit for their products. Mainly because our products fit so well. You know, they're very, if you go over there and travel, there's, there's uh, very similar to what we see here in North Dakota, South Dakota, Minnesota, you know, large, large acreage, big farms, um, need for big heavy equipment to get over the fields fast. A company that spent more than 50 years building trust among North American farmers has a brighter future because it's reached out to the rest of the world. For Ag Week, this is Mikkel Pates in Devil's Lake, North Dakota.